Good morning, my beautiful kings and queens. It's Tuesday, March 31st, 2015. Hopefully you are up in Adam, <clears throat> excuse me, doing something necessary to establish your kingdom, your kingdom. Are you on your way to work? Are you on your way to class? Are you doing something productive that can change your life? It's all on you. It is your job to make your life better. Nobody is going to give it to you. We've seen that and we know that. You are in control of your destiny. So get out there, do something, and go be great. This morning, what's on my mind is this whole, everybody's in an uproar about that law that's been passed or that's trying to be passed in Indiana. Um, people are upset because they feel that it discriminates against a certain um, group of people and against a certain culture. And my question is, what about all the laws and practices that have been in place since the beginnings of time to discriminate against people? Um, how about that one big thing called slavery? That was quite discriminatory. Yet it doesn't even, it doesn't even get the, the same amount of attention that it should. We are still dealing with discriminatory laws in place from slavery that are still in effect today. So for everybody to be so mad about some business people choosing not to cater to that. Being gay is a choice. Being black ain't. That's just how I feel. You don't agree? It's okay. And I'm not totally against homosexuals. I have a homo I have homosexual family members, homosexual friends. That's their choice. I don't agree with it completely, but I feel that if a business chooses not to cater to that, that's their choice. Being black was not a choice. Yet I'm discriminated against every day. People that look just like me are discriminated against every day. So while everybody's so mad about this one law, think about the millions of laws that have been passed based off of slavery practices if that ain't discrimination i don't know what is y'all it's up to us those of you who are out there and you have children and you watching this the future is in your hands our our children are our future so what are you doing out there what are you doing to impact your future are you making sure your child knows what they need to know to, to stay caught up with society? Or are they a social media baby? Y'all, that stuff, it, it's important. And to my black people, I'm speaking to you. It, I'm speaking to y'all directly. We already know all the odds are against us. So why do we keep feeding into the stereotypes and these why why do we keep playing this game why do we keep acting like niggers excuse my french but that is what we keep acting like it's time to stop it is time to be done with it it's up to us sandy speaks